bet you guys are probably wondering why am I playing City Skyline? Why haven't I uploaded a video within the last little few weeks? Within the last week, I guess. Um, the, the biggest issue that I've had is And these are duplicate prefab names, which some assets are broken, I get that. So, as you guys know, um, I've kind of had things going out here throughout the city. Um, and as you know, I've got some new assets in here today, guys. Like this, the 7 Eleven gas station. So we're just gonna get down there for this guy. We're gonna throw a couple, we're gonna throw a little bit of the 7 Eleven gas station. This isn't new, guys. This has actually been in the city before. Uh, this has been in me getting these assets prior. Okay, we're going to start throwing 7-Elevens around in the city, guys. Um, now, okay, sewage is recovering a little bit of that issue again. So, what we need to do uh, we need to add more Okay, so we have this issue here, guys.
Okay. This is kind of built upon water, but there isn't. There is a little bit more heating into the city now. Um, those are able to be included there, so we get a little bit of heating along that edge. You know, giving people an extra option to go out a different way, out of here, is a better option. Now, we have policing issues, guys. So, we're going to put a small police station down over here. Kind of get that access. Then put one there. And there. Okay. Now, as you guys know, we actually have, have issues down in the S area with traffic. Okay, a lot of people are wanting to leave out this way, but can't. So, You know, and there is a highway access down over here, but it's mostly, why are these guys filling over here? Okay. Maybe we'll include that guy, these guys as being okay. So now that we've updated that there, I try to include this yield sign right there, guys. Oftentimes, it looks like
Ta da! <laughs> Fixed ya. Didn't realize that we had an issue like that. Okay. Okay. Not allow for people to cross that way. Probably forty miles an hour now. But could I, if I were to? No, oh. Um. I put your back in the way that it's supposed to be. But now that's going to allow for people to to get around. A lot better now. We know that we have So it's mostly right here in this area. Um, so let's look at these. Okay. And look at here. Maybe we'll start and say, hey, you want to go that way? Now it'll be... Changing that there might help improve on traffic flow. Um, let's go. Let's go there and let's say do that. Maybe that'll help improve a little bit on that traffic flow a little bit. So, okay, what I'm thinking, let's, let's clear you out here. Um, OK, 
Okay. Now that's a small, tiny little roundabout. But we can maybe do something like that. Um, and then we can do something like and then what we can do is I want to see if we can just slightly move it over Okay, we can move you over even, even more. And then I don't know, help with that a little bit. Add more into a roundabout there. It's a small one. Now, what we can do is we're going to say, you can go there, you can go there. And then... No. And then we'll do something like that. And that kind of turn of events, it's got another roundabout way. There's another roundabout. So that's going to help traffic flow a little bit better there. Okay. Um, now what I'm thinking is is this is a round of this is a one-way street. Let's just upgrade these. One-way. Okay, and then we'll leave that to be accessible. And then, 
and then we'll start going Now I think we can upgrade these. Upgrade those to meet more better standards. No. Yeah, that one fits just fine. Okay, then I come down here. We'll say you can only turn. And if we can improve on, um, if we can find ways to improve on traffic flow. You know, look at this. If we can do three lanes this way, and then we come down here, we say, we'll use, because you can see that's, Uh, hold on. That's only still only a one way road there as well. Um Let's go. Okay, and then we do the same thing, we go down here, and we say, right, and turn. And if we can start kind of trying to make our road flow a lot better. Okay, we only need to go right. We need to do something like that there. Okay. And then we come over here. It'll make it so much simpler. Um, we will actually take yeah we'll do something like that i think you come down here Because most of it is just this round, this kind of thing right here. And I'm not quite sure.
We're gonna clear that out right in those two spots there because of it. And then we're gonna also drop a three off of there. And the same thing there. We'll drop four off actually. But we will allow it to be back on that side of the road. Because it's, and then, why do you? Okay. Now we're going to the firehouse over there. There. So it's only going in one direction. But what I'm also going to do is do we have, we do have this. I want to create one where I think, hold on. I think let's do something let's do something where no we're gonna put you back that way there where what I'm gonna do is we're gonna change the stuff around here. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. And then where's the other one way? All roads are no longer going to be one way. They're going to be. Except for right in that area there. It's going one way this way. Which it should be. Uh, okay. So it's now allowing it to go both directions, but we're going to restrict. Okay. No. Okay. Just so that, um, we'll do the same thing over here. Basically, no. We're allowing it so that these vehicles have a equal chance to get around for like emergency and garbage. So that garbage and SOS vehicles can get around a lot quicker here. Um, and there are parts that we're missing that need to be fixed here. So So this way, so it'll help traffic flow a lot nicer here, guys. Nope. <coughs> 
Oh, excuse me. Oh. Ugh. Okay. Sorry about that. Um. So this is what's gonna basically. We'll see if this works. Because this is gonna allow for emergency vehicles to get around. Um. We might even say. We might even say we allow those type of vehicles, taxis getting around, like stuff like that, but. No, hold on. Nope. Yeah, I was right. That'll help traffic flow hopefully a lot better, allowing for vehicles, you know, Because we have a lot more people trying to go that way. I feel like that's going to help improve, and it's going to allow cars to travel a lot better. Maybe we don't toggle traffic lights in uh, in certain. Like maybe we don't have traffic lights in some of these spots that you know. Maybe we just get rid of traffic lights altogether.
Oh, traffic flow. It's thirty five percent. You know what? I'm going to take and I'm going to say, let's do cars can only. Now cars can only use, anybody can use these. But cars cannot, like car, like anyone cars, like maybe we might have better luck. Luck. This is an industrial area, but maybe we it can reduce the car. Maybe allowing for people to go in. <laughs> Maybe allowing. Okay, and maybe what we do is we allowed that going through. Maybe. So it's like, this is the main highway. But a lot of it is people just like, now we're starting to see blockage down in here too. So, We're going to say nobody who wants to get on, they have to go this way, this way. Now we yield there. Put yield signs there. Okay. I feel like that a lot of it is just them coming over to this thing.
But I feel like it's mostly because these guys are trying to stop. You know, okay, and we got like so I gotta look at all this and say. And I'm actually I'm gonna say, let's clear that out. Let's do this for there. Let's make sure that those go in into those two lanes. It'll make things flow a lot better. Okay. And then we can say, you can go into that way. You can go there to there. You can go there to there. You can go there to there. We'll put that into like, we'll do it like kind of. Something like that, except this one goes to there. And that goes to there. And then we'll hit control S. And we can allow for it. Okay, so it allows for them to cut up there, okay? And then maybe we do something like that. And then we say, okay, we allow you to travel in those two zones there. Actually, we'll allow you to travel like that. Not if you're coming in. Kind of. Okay. Um. Just to allow a little bit faster moving traffic. Because I have a sneaky suspicion that that's what was happening, is that traffic flow. 
And as you can see, we only have two lanes there. We can change that. It's, we can change this. It might mean that we have to go down here and say, and say there's only no and I'll do that maybe help improve traffic flow a lot better there and you can go into all three of those lines there And then you guys can go in those three lanes, not and it might help traffic flow a lot nicer there, you know. You know, you look at these, they come, they go this way. We're also going to allow it's gonna be we're gonna allow you and you and we're going to allow people like that to travel and cross into that lane as they so choose um, that to flow a lot nicer and I have a feeling doing this helping flow traffic a lot nicer already is at 26% flow traffic flow but I think helping improve down here, I think will improve our traffic flow immensely. Okay. Now, we still need solar power, solar drift power. So what I want to do is I want to finish by putting something like that in the play. but only right here, allowing for no trucks, no cars, only allowing for those kinds of people to go through that way, allowing for them to have that access, which right there is also is going to allow for for rotation. Nobody needs, we're going to hit control, shift, no. There doesn't need to be anything there anyways. That'll help traffic flow immensely a lot better in here. Hopefully. You know, allowing for, like, you know, you could take into this thing, it allows for you to slowly move in and maneuver around but now that it allows for people to utilize that nature I think it'll help you know they come in they're waiting to get in right so they go in they you're in here you go this way you go this way you go this way and then you can change lanes however you need to like if you're in the red one it allows you to go into this one okay if you're in or go this way if you're allowed in the green one, we'll just hit this blue one, which you can go here. And then this will allow you to go in. And it may not be that this middle lane might not get used as often, but it will for these guys coming off, pretty much. So I think it'll help improve on traffic flow a lot nicer and a lot better. And if you look at it, traffic flow is only 28%, but it is, but it will improve through here. If that'll help us improve eventually, 
okay? Our traffic flow is going to get, as soon as this kind of help clears things out, I think it'll help improve on traffic flow in general. So if we go in here and we say, we got, we got three lanes. So maybe what we do is, maybe we come down here. And as you can see, we can't really, we can't really upgrade that point right there because road's in the way. So let's go, let's put you out first. Go back by a little bit. Let's upgrade you. And then we'll throw you back this way. Then Yep. Okay, that's going to help improve on traffic flow here in general. Because what we're going to do is we're going to say, let's go there. And then allow you guys to go into that section there. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to basically not allow for people to. And then. I'm going to hit control S there, allowing, and we're also going to hit control S there as well, as we're now getting on, um, then I'll hit control S there, but instead of doing it like that, we will take you to go there, clearing you out like so, take you there, um, and then I'm going to hit control S, do the same thing there, except we're going to also allow green to transfer like so there. Um, actually, no, let's clear you guys out of these. So, like, like that's going to hog things up, so no, we're going to, we're going to refix that. Fix that there. Um, we're trying to fix traffic today. Is going to be the biggest. Yeah. Um. But what I'm actually I'm going to do is if you're coming off, all I'm going to do is just have you guys go straight like so. Do the same thing here, just have you go straight. Only in those spots will they do that. Because I would like to have one where they can easily 
pants or you know um we're gonna put in these two spots right here we're gonna allow for people to to cross We need to up we need to get rid of that automatic bulldozer though. We're gonna clear out the no policy on people using this as a crosswalk. And look, our traffic flow is 33%. It's going to start becoming a lot faster here, guys. So, now that we have fixed a lot of the traffic issues, like, because these guys don't have a lot of rotation, okay? You know, no, and then we also know that it's a lot of that is people are just going around and around in circles and circles. Okay. Do we actually? Where's our bus line at? Metro tram, trolleys, cable car, monorails, taxis, bus stops. It doesn't look like that we have many bus routes down here in general. In general, like, we have a blimp ride, but we don't have... I'm going to improve with another taxi stop in that spot there. We're going to improve a little bit down here with a little bit more taxis. Then we're going to place the cable car and there. And then and I think let's just go up by Invalid. Okay. That's going to help people get across and get around a little bit better. 
you know, people are going to have that transportation. Like, I always like using, like, as you can see, there's not a lot of people trying to, like, it's slow, guys. Like, being able to allow to have more transportation in the city is so much better like yeah we have metro going out around there but we don't have metro out here so let's get let's start by placing by placing a metro station there Let's go there. Let's come. Let's put. Let's put one. Let's put one there. Let's go and put one there. And let's put one there. And then. Let's go there with that there with that one um that does not look like it goes out so we can do put one there um actually let's clear you out um let's <sighs> Let's put one there. And then we'll add one there. Okay. Okay, that one I feel like is too close to each other. Other, so we're gonna move you over a little bit. Cause I feel like it's a little too close. And then I kinda wanna just Oh wait, no, hold on. We'll just do something like that, I guess. And then let's do something like that. Now we have ourselves a train route. Now I am going to extend this out to this railway line there I'm going to clear I'm going to keep actually let's keep this line there just in case we're going to have the inner train that's going around this way and the other train kind of thing but we'll have it just in case like we need to so so we're going to start here, we're going to go down to here, we're going to go all the 
Uh -huh. And then we'll start by creating another metro line because I think we might be able to get a lot more people moving around this round in certain areas. And then we add you to there, and then we go down to there. Now we're going to create a new line. Okay, so as you can see, it's not going to be able to make it there. So being the person I am, we're going to go the opposite direction using the, it'll be one less station for this one, but it'll still allow for people It'll still allow for access so that people who are coming in this way can go this way. We can stop there. Now we have more transportation methods. Okay. Well, heating availability is off. So... So heating availability There's a lot of places without heating Yay! Power for these guys down here. It would allow for it better, much more. Actually, let me move. Get us up there and put more power to these guys just that they have power and so that our heating availability has been improved now which is on the other side of this now our traffic flow has dripped again, but I think allowing for more transportation methods, like look, we're having, the biggest thing is, is that this is where a lot of our industries at in general, and we're having issues with connectivity issues. So, and as you can see, a lot of it is just this big roundabout right here what I'm thinking we're going to change this we're going to say we're going to take and we're going to change a lot of our nothing we're going to say no trucks allowed going on and it will change our perspective no more trucks. No more of those trucks coming in on these these two roads. Now 
No more trucks going in on that Rose Road. That'll help improve on traffic flow a little bit. Just for that area there. Alright, there. Um, that is allowed. That is still decent. There. So, you know, if we say we limit trucks coming on, that means they will use other areas. Say, over here. They go, they get on there. Or using other areas like this. Okay. Here, we're just gonna go this. And I'm gonna use uh, toggle automatic despawning. Anywho. I don't know why I got rid of it, to be honest with you. Um, I will allow it. I'm not going to allow trucks like that anyway. Anywho. Um, trucks that want to, it's now going to be, they'll come out into these areas here first. Um, over in those two, and allow that for generalized, normalized traffic. Don't get why I didn't, why I had that disabled. I was wondering why traffic was being, ish, being issueized. Um. So, and as you can see, power, is somewhat of that issue here. So, and then, Well, we still have issues down in this area. But now forcing vehicle, forcing on ramp and off ramp. I think what we'll do is we're going to force also. And we're going to focus the traffic off onto these areas. Areas. So that there's not so much congestion over here. Here. And allow for them. Um, we have a slip lane there. I am. Um, and I know that we have a slip lane here, because I know that, I put that there. There needs to be, like, I feel like that we should have verticality. Verticality. And what I'm also going to do is I think I'm going to also start dropping. Okay, what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to start dropping. Um... 
I think I'm going to start dropping people off from the areas near the roundabout. We're going to start dropping more off from that roundabout. Put you into play there. Because I think dropping off more off closer into the roundabout is just going to drop you off there as well. We're going to clear you out in general there and there. Making Okay, not enough heat, right? So, now. What we need to do is we need to go geo Yep. I know. We have that na nature of the atrocity here. That just means that now we have more access. Now. <sighs> We're going to actually extend that to three lanes. Uh, no, actually, we only need to do a. Well, I need to really do it two lanes. Allowing for that to be the, like that, so they can come in here if they need to and access it. I don't get why. Um. Uh, now, what I'm also going to do, guys, we're going to now come over here, we're going to make, we're going to cut out a little bit of XX section here, we're going to start by creating another highway here, um, we don't, we're going to go with Um, okay. Okay. And now we're going to go back to highway management. Let's go, let's actually extend this to four lanes going out. And three lanes there. 
Okay. Then we're going to upgrade you to four lanes, upgrade you to four lanes, upgrade you to four lanes. Okay. No, and then I think we only really need two lanes there. Um, so it'll be like an international highway. We're going to go... I'm going to go up to that point there. That point there. And then... Now... What I would like it to do is to come down over here, which is, which already is extended by a three lane road. So we'll start with going, start going up to that point there for three lanes, and then we will shift you that way. Okay. Now, let's go into let's go this way okay So it kind of stays somewhat the same. All right, and then let's go a little bit forward to somewhat match that, and then we just, I did this the wrong way. And then let's go, go forward. A little bit more. Okay, we're going to stick it to three lanes. I'm going to stick it to mostly three lanes going, going that way. And then it's going to start changing to two lane roads. Okay, and then let's go a little bit up further, and then can we bring you up a little bit further and allow you to go somewhat like this? Nope, okay, let's go this way. No, let's... No. Um... Okay, let's try to go a little bit further. Okay, as you can see, that's too far. Let's go back home. Let's go back that way. And then, I think that should be... Now that should allow for much more better... Um, Because I'm thinking what we're going to do is I'm going to move a lot of the industry from out of here and move it over to here. Which, if we look at the, uh, 
destructive garbage, but the natural resources. This doesn't really have any natural resources, but we're going to move it over here. We'll put this as a forestry, this as a um, industry area. area. And if we can create this more as an industrial area, area and leave this off, we would actually probably get more people, more less congestion over here. You know, we'd have the congestion over here. We'd still keep the train station where it's at for cargo, but we would start reducing the car, the transmission of that. So let's take our road. We're going to start by Got it. And then we're going to go up to there. Um, and then I'll go up to that point there. I'm pretty sure that's one. And then one, okay, we're, the spaghetti effect. Some intersections are more beautiful than others. The study digs deep into the science of the intersection. Okay. And then go down like so. I think what we'll do is let's take that one can stay, this one can stay, this one can go, and that one can go. And then we'll drop you down like so. Okay. And now what we're going to do is let's take Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to put all of and then And we're also going to get there too so that people can't, like, you got two connections there. That is because that is connecting right off onto an intersection, which. Okay.
We're going to start by removing a lot of... Okay, we're starting to move a lot of the industry over here into this island so that they are not so, so they're segregated from a lot of Okay, when we're starting to move over here Okay, we're still going to keep oh, some of the industry, but we're starting to clear it out slowly. And clear it. And then we need to get people piped up over here. To get people piped up. Okay. Um, this. is going to be moved out of there we're going to shift and move we're going to shift and move Because if we can start moving, moving a lot of our industry, we're kind of starting to shift a lot of things. Off of the roads over here, they divided that one. We start by removing a lot of that and making a move over here. Because if we can start by doing that, guys, like that's going to be a lot safer for us in general. Then I'm going to clear you out there because you're no longer needed or wanted. Uh, we'll still keep some of that over here, but we're starting to kind of clear it off those kinds of roads and starting to put in 
Um, because what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to start by replacing a lot of a lot of things is we're going to start by putting in more generalized office space along that edge right there. We're going to do the same thing here. More office space, but still allowing for We're still having a lot in some industry over here, okay? You know, kind of starting to reduce a lot of the traffic down in here. And when that becomes the issue, and we're starting to see that we're gonna start by putting an IT cluster down in here. All right. We're going to put high tech industry down in here. So anything Okay. So this is going to be a place of Holly Square is also going to have a policy for city planning. Industry 4.0 will be in here. Okay. So that these guys and we're also going to put um, that there as well. Um, And then and then I gotta find oh it's in here guys it's in here And we'll put IT cluster in here, guys, so that, you know, it's going to be industry 4.0 down here. So it's going to help IT cluster. It's going to reduce a lot of traffic flow. You know, we're going to see a lot of cars that are going to come this way and for cargo because there's, because it's over here. We might move it over to here, but. But allowing for high tech gad like high tech stuff, this is where our IT cluster is gonna start coming in. We're gonna start seeing IT clusters. We're gonna start seeing more of our industry start shaping okay um this is an oil power plant our oil power plant is now going to be moved down here okay anything power planty 
um, like these two incineration plants, um, Can I go from here and then find a happy medium? Because what I want to start trying to do is move a lot of our incineration plants from over there. Because if we can if we can move a lot of our incineration from away from these guys, like they're gonna have a lot more happier but this is gonna be the i t cluster of things. Um, guys are starting to shift. I'm starting to shift a lot of our recycling. There's another incineration plant. Move you there. You know, so flying high tech industry to be in here, a lot of this is starting to become a more office oriented industry. Um, I feel like let's clear. Out. Let's move. You are going to get moved as well. Um, so you're going to move to move down to there. Nope. And I'm going to put IT there. Now. Let's move. Let's keep you there. That's going to allow for that there. We're going to now start by any IT. Um, we're going to replace you with residential there just to allow for a little bit more residential. Um, I think we can put some residential there. Allowing for some height. C cluster sitting there. We're going third off of that point there. Um, I'm going to put some IT cluster there. Put some. Residential and then put residential there. We're going to clear that there. It's still going to follow that we still have those one lane roads, but I'm actually. I'm going to start by leaving it the way that we have it set up, but this time um, we're going to start going
um, we're gonna flip that around to there. Then we'll swap it. We'll make it so that roads are improving. And then we're basically changing things up. I'm going to you. I'm going to make like roads that are. Um, I want to use, I want to use this rainbow road again. I'm going to use it. And like, this is for like, if you guys don't know, I got a few different assets. I'm not going to, I'm going to go. I'm going to basically constitute this as a four lane road. Um. Now, I know that we cannot connect straight into that, but we're still going to act fully as um, I'm actually thinking, let's go 